The emphasis on the liberal arts education drew me out of my comfort zone to try and explore new topic areas. By going through the liberal arts curriculum, I've taken classes that I never would have otherwise. I've taken a literature class called Race and Popular Music. I, I took this astronomy class that wound up inspiring all of this um, poetry and writing that I was doing for other classes because I was, you know, then sitting on the green with a telescope. It, it was way outside of my comfort zone, but I think that's really what the liberal arts is about, is, is showing these connections between all of these different things and, um, you know, making you better at the things that you're already interested in. I've been able to take classes like video games and the meaning of life or introduction to classical archaeology in a way that I might not have been able to if Dartmouth didn't encourage me to explore outside my interests. I took a women in journalism class for my first year seminar and it really opened my eyes to a bunch of different issues. They've all really broadened my scope and my knowledge on different cultures and socioeconomic ideas and history and stuff like that. It forces you to educate yourself, especially nowadays with the modern social movements. Uh, it's allowed me to meet people I never would have. You know, you know, the, the people that I met in my philosophy class, they were all classics people who you know, I never would have um, interacted with if it wasn't for that class. So I'm very grateful for the liberal arts curriculum, not only for the academic material that it's put me in contact with, but more so with, with the people. I was passionate about a lot of different things and I didn't have a way to combine them. But luckily, thanks to the liberal arts curriculum that Dartmouth has and the philosophy that it's built on, which really encourages you to branch out to try new things, I was able to find sort of a middle ground that has produced who I am today as a student. I think that the liberal arts curriculum is not something anyone should fear. It's just something that will teach you how to think. And when you are in a professional setting 20 years from now and you are having a meal with people, you'll be able to talk about things that are beyond your profession and that are more about what makes us innately human. You'll be able to be an interesting person and not just a great professional.